What's good, everybody? This is Kali Pierre at SGF. This has been day three. Got a chance to check out the amazing game, Hyperlight Breaker from Heart Machine. Been a big fan of the game from the previous game and now getting a chance to check out their open world beat em up. This game feels fantastic. The combat felt great. The maneuverability felt fantastic. The way you kind of play with the tools that you're given, both on the melee side and on the weapon side in terms of ranged weapons felt really, really cool. There's this balance of different kinds of weapons in terms of rarity, you know, stuff that you're usually kind of accustomed to when it comes to, you know, finding good loot within that space, because it is a looter shooter in a lot of different ways. And what I came away from it with was like, oh man, the team from Heart Machine really understands how fantastically to make a game. And they really understand their aesthetic and their audience. I think this game is going to be one that I'm going to come back to a bunch of times and understand that like, this is a thing that when you see the indie space continue to grow and you see it grow from where they started into where they are now, it just makes it really, really fun to be able to see teams grow and be as good as they are at what they do. And I think Hyperlight Breaker is a fantastic example of what that means for the indie space. So massive love to the team from Heart Machine. Really excited about Hyperlight Breaker. And man, the gameplay was super on point. Got a chance to check out some of the boss battles. Got a chance to traverse their open world. And it feels like everything is feeling really cohesive in terms of what they're bringing out to market. So massive love to them. And we'll talk to you very, very soon. Make sure you're checking out everything on our TikTok and YouTube. And we'll talk to you soon. Peace.